YouTube, it's me, Jen, your pudgy picker. Got another Monday thrift haul for you. Did pretty good. You could tell I got a decent amount of stuff on my table today. Um, found a couple things that I've bought before and I know sell well for me. And a few new items. Because, you know, you got to keep it fresh. <sighs> I'm sorry I'm out of breath. I just chased the dogs. <laughs> okay, let's jump right in. Two shirts today. This one is a Romans. It is size 20. It was $7.49 or $3.75. A little higher than I like to pay, but I haven't been buying much shirts lately. Not sure. Hopefully donations will pick up. Um, this one is a three-quarter sleeve and this one is as well. This one is an Avenue. It is a $26.28. Um, looks kind of a thermal shirt, but it's just a thinner version and real pretty blues and whites and some embellishment. Got this uh, for $3.50. It is a metal uh, lighthouse and it has a uh, candle with lighthouses on it as well. Do a little bit of cleaning up on that. Very good price. Nautical stuff always does real well for me. So that was a definite easy pickup. You can tell I got three items here, and I got one out of the package for four total. And it's a chicken. It's a fabric chicken, like a felt. Uh, they stand up pretty good. These were all new in the package. $4.99 each or $2.50, so $10 for all four of them. Uh, chicken decorations do pretty well, and not sure how these will do. But I've sold uh, rooster uh, like doorstops and little ceramic things and cookie jars and different things. So, yeah, hopefully these guys will do pretty good. Um, this is a vintage latch hook kit, still sealed. It was four dollar or five dollars, so it's two fifty. It is Karen brand. It does not have a barcode. You could tell it's very seventies ish because of having an owl and it also the colors. Um, I got this interesting cane. Looks like a saw head. It was $2.99 or $1.50. It is solid wood. I have some new uh, cane tips. I always pick them up when I can, so I will probably replace that before I take it out to my booth. I got these small uh, matching pictures. Uh, got some different uh, tropical plants on them. They were $2.99 each or $3 for both. It has this interesting kind of uh, stands away from the wall, which is kind of cool. Uh, this is made to look old, but it is not. It is a wall lantern that has the, uh, it's like a jar style glass. Um, these, uh, a lot of people love these. And when I saw it, I thought, that's really awesome. So I'll have to do my research, of course. But for $3.50, I figured it was definitely worth it. I did open it up and made sure that nothing was broken. So not too bad. Got this real pretty blue glass. It is hand blown, if you can tell where they busted it off. Um, it was a dollar. Um, in my shipping room, I have a, a little metal container. It's like a mesh container that holds my pens and pencils, and it falls over all the time, and it drives me crazy. So I thought if I get something a little bit heavier, that would work better. So that's what I got. Um, these two jars, one's a little bit shorter than the other. They were both $1.99 or $1 each. Um, I get these. I fill them up with shells. And then I will glue the top on, and then I usually put some raffia or a little piece of a fish net on there. And those always sell really well in my booth. Um, this little family tree with the different uh, places you can put pictures. You could tell it's still wrapped. I think it is a Malden, is it? Yeah. And it's very adorable, looks brand new. It was only $3.50. So I picked that up. That will probably go out to my booth. Something that I've bought before is these fish. I'm sure you've seen them before. Uh, these are $3.99 each, and then half price there too. They're kind of like a lacquered, 
uh, finish on them. Not sure what they're made out of, but these always sell real well. Probably sell them for probably $6 a piece. Uh, so something I always do pick up when I see them because I know they do really well for me. Uh, got this real interesting piece. It is, if I can pick it up, a wooden chihuahua. Look at that. It's got the different color wood. It almost looks like a puzzle. Isn't that beautiful? Um, this was only $3, and it says handcrafted by Mike and Janet's Crafts. So not sure where that's from, but I thought that was quite pretty. So that will probably go on eBay. I will do my research, of course. But I thought that was a beautiful... I mean, that must have took a lot of work to make that. Um, also, I got some rubber stamps. They were in a bag for $6 or $3 each. Um, one says, happy birthday. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, have a butterfly, best wishes. Uh, an angel with stars, some ivy. These two I really like the best. It's a little window and it says hello. And this one says thank you. And then welcome baby and happy birthday to you. It's got birds. This is some items that I have been picking up for my booth, but the stamps haven't been doing so good in my booth. I don't know, it seems like somebody will come along every once in a while and buy a whole bunch. So I'm probably going to be bringing them home and kind of grouping them together and then listing them on eBay. Um, this is one of the items that I always pick up. These are like brand new. <sighs> and my brain is saying, don't pick those up. People aren't really buying those. And I say, shut up. And then I put it in the cart anyway. So yeah, do you have an item that you do that to? I really got to stop. <laughs> I mean, $3 for all of these is a great price, but if they're not selling, then it's a waste of money. So yeah, some of my internal dialogue I have when I'm at the thrift store. So that is all I found this week. I hope you enjoyed this haul. Um, give me a thumbs up, please. Also uh, hit the subscribe button if you aren't already. And if you click on the bell, you will be notified when I put up a new video. You can also follow me on Twitter and Instagram under The Pudgy Picker. And also, if you have a comment on anything I bought or any idea how much I should sell it for, I would appreciate that as well. So thank you for watching. I will see you next time. And until then, happy picking. Bye.